This is dangerous. Best snack. Guys, you know you tell that. Yeah, you know I'm a rep for it. Like I said, Ganu lost, Cedric lost. We're not losing today. You see what I'm saying? And we are back, not. Back type right back, dude. Socks type right back. Oh, okay. Are you even at the to hunt? Let's, let's see. <laughs> let's see. I got some good snacks here. I want to start with this snack right here. So, this is what we call caramel. Like, um, English translation is caramel. You see what I'm saying? Um, it's literally just nuts covered in glazed caramel. They dry it off and. We're gonna do this all authentic right here. Guys, this comes from the motherland, Jacob. Bro, I brought this from back home. Nice. First time that Jacob's actually yeah. at try, so it's so cool. Try try to say it. Kahamel. 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 Yes. Oh yes, sir. Alright, and then you just you just toss it back like yeah. as you're walking. Is that walk? I mean one one by one. Yeah, yeah. Let's... Yeah, one by one. What do you think, bro? It's so good. Crunchy. It's literally just it's literally just nuts, guys. What do you think about the flavor? Mm, nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Well? Texture ten out of ten. Because honestly, the flavor is so good. With that crunch, I love crunchy things. That's like super crunchy. Mm. Also, I think the the nut, the flavor and the nut really balances out how sweet it is too. So. What do you mean by that? I'm just gonna go seed chair because it is pretty basic and like. I don't know, like, I have had, like, sugar nuts eaten in uh, this heat. <laughs> in terms of texture, we can't beat it. So we gotta put it in the uh, beach. Let's put it in beach here. Well, I'm putting it in beach here, bro. Closest so, thing that we could get to in terms of a nut snack. Okay. Sugary nut snack is on these cashews and planters is the classic, like, American brand. And then, the ring looks exactly similar to this one. Let me show you guys up close and personal. This is, like... Look at that. And then Jacob's bringing us this right here. Don't roll. Uh -huh. These don't look like they're gonna be as pranked. Sure, this is my first time having planters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I grew up a little some Oh. Super good combination. This is really good. It's sweet. Have you guys if if you guys know about you know, Auntie Anne. Auntie Anne, this is cinnamon bun. A cashew version of it. Yeah, the only way it tastes like Stanley. I'm gonna eat it like I would eat a back hole. It's good. Not as crunchy. Yeah, I'd have to say we got nine out of ten in terms of flavor, initial two is nine out of ten in terms of aftertaste. Everything nut. Yep. Everything nut. So I gotta have to put it in my eighty tier. Make sure for snacks, yep. Mel. Hey, first win for the U.S. and Yo, hold on. America's going out on top of this one. Coming back, right? Let's go. A tier for me, too. A tier. Nice. Mm -hmm. This is really good, bro. I'm finishing the whole thing. Cool. So, I'm putting I'm putting those cashews at an A tier. Yeah, same. A tier, same. A tier. Yeah. After chase type story. That was, that was surprisingly good, bro. Yeah, I'm no, nah, I didn't think they were about... I'm going to come up. That pressure is on. That's why we're coming with this bad boy right here. For all my people, this is called Ching Ching. It's a cookie that is baked. Obviously, cookies are baked. This one's a little bit different, right? Most are like natural flavors, but this one is like vanilla flavored right here. We eat. It's 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 to die for. It's to die for. And guys, like I said, everything on this video is authentic, right? Um, so. Let's open this up right here. This is called Ching Ching right here. As you can see, the bag used to be full. <laughs> oh man, I killed New York Freshton. I killed this. I came back home like two months ago and this is what I came with just to remind me of back home. And Jacob, this is looking forward to that. Yes, sir. I like the I did with the uh, I just wish you could have it fresh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When they first made it. When the bag was like completely sealed, but hey, I'm not, I'm not gonna sway you any other way. But I think this is really good taste. Taste is solid eight and a half. In terms of taste, like I compare it to like a shortcake, like a strawberry shortcake. But I'm gonna have to put it on the B tier just because it's like not such a super strong flavor. In terms of taste, I would give it like a seven and a half and eight, eight and a half maximum. 
I would put this a B tier. Same thing. I'll put this a B tier. I'm actually surprised with my rating. Yeah, I know. Like, I'm actually surprised. The nostalgic, man, it, like, added value. That was a pretty objective. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just trying to be honest. You see what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, I'm giving... How would you... What is this called? Um, ching, ching. Chick, ching. Okay, then. Okay, then. Yeah, I'm giving Chick, ching, B tier. Into. Yep. See if a uh, pepperidge farm can match the Ooh, match. Isn't that like butter cooking? Yeah. The same type of texture call. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be a tough matchup, guys. Tough matchup. I was looking forward to this. This is the first time I'm having it. Not like not like it tastes like an egg, but I feel like it has like the aftertaste of like the sugar cookie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like sugar cookies that press or something. Mm-hmm. It's like this, you know, like crunchier. Mm-hmm. Melty, eggy, that combo right there. A little buttery. I was expecting more of a buttery taste. I mean, it's good. Packaging, you cannot go wrong with chessmen cookies. You can't. Packaging is insane. It's like, I, when I see it, I want to try it. Exactly, right? They look so, like, crisp and toasty. Mm-hmm. Packaging is, honestly, 10 out of 10. I'm not even going to look. Oh, definitely. Like, um, the paper, everything, like... You guys can't see it, but they have some sort of lining inside to keep the cookies fresh. Um, packaging, 10 out of 10. Uh, flavor, 7 out of 10. Flavor is 7 out of 10. I would think for me, it have to be like a 4 out of 10, just because it's kind of bland. Tastes like a sugar cookie. Not if you try the sugar cookies, so I always have to say 4 out of 10. Is this going to be your first F for a snack? Yeah, it might be my first F. No way. I'm not crazy about this. Like, really? Would not. I would not buy them. Really? I feel like for me, D tier is I would not buy. F tier would not buy. C tier like maybe. B tier, yeah. If I'm if I'm going in 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 the shop and the stores, Walmart, whatever, um, half and half, 50 50 I'm getting it. A more than likely I'm getting it. S I'm definitely getting it. Also like D tier like. It's like an occasional fight for me. Exactly. And now that you say that, I wouldn't occasionally buy this. I wouldn't. It might be a D. Might be my first D tier right here. Yeah. Just. Dylan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These nuts. Ha! <laughs> Got him! The vanilla wafers. There's a heavy hitter right here. In, in, in terms of vanilla cookies, like this is like the red fade strand. Yeah, we can get it for it. Oh, the smell is so vanilla. Yeah, it's a uh, net. Like as soon as you open the bag, it's like you're smelling vanilla extract or something. Yeah, honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheers, the layers. Cheers. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Banger. Banger. Tastes like vanilla. Take a spot on vanilla. And then this is banger right here. Texture is fire. Flavor is fire. Aftertaste is fire. Everything's fire. This is really good. And you like vanilla. This is like the slack for you guys. And then, this is really good, guys. Super crunchy. Really sweet. The aftertaste, honestly. Like, obviously, texture is there. And then, I'm going there for some more, bro. Oh, dude. Hell yeah. And, like, I know. Yep. That's exactly it. Vanilla wafers are used for, like, banana pudding. If you guys can see it right here. It literally gives you the ingredients on how to make banana pudding. And I know a family friend of mine. Shout out Lucy. She makes the, a killer, killer banana pudding. And the vanilla wafers really reminds me of that. Having them on their own, yeah. Put them in any dessert. I and mean, put them in any dessert. Crunch them up and put them in some ice holes. Have it with milk alone. This gas. S tier. Yeah, S tier. S tier. We just had a crop, so yeah, definitely S tier. Yeah, bro. S tier, bro. The flavor is, is just as good as the aftertaste. Mm-hmm. Exactly. RG. This is my hidden weapon. Jacob has his hidden weapon. And it's time to settle the score. Cameroonian snacks versus American snacks. Comes down to this. Comes down to this. And this is the top dog right here. No, this is this is the top dog right here. <laughs> like that video. Like the video if you think this is the top dog right here. Yeah. And subscribe if you think this is the top dog. Hey, let's see. Let's see. The ball wants to go first. You want to go first? Yeah, let's see it. All right. Best snack 
coconut palms and or do the coconut head them on thank god america versus camera this is dangerous this is dangerous what are they called mountains yeah it's literally just coconut surrounded by chocolate oh my gosh it's dangerous have you had bouncy before uh no nah, no this this like reminds me of like bouncy and stuff oh my gosh all right cheers mm -hmm. yeah oh yeah Oh yeah. Did. So well. Guys, this deserves a belly rub. If you see me rub my belly, ten. That's what you know. This is fire. This is fire. This is fuego. This isn't this isn't fire. This is fuego. Nice. Real coconut. Was real coconut? Mm -hmm. Wow. Let me show you guys. Real coconut. Chocolate covered. This is really good. All enjoys are similar, but it's not a bit difficult. Oh no, I'm kind of scared. Hit it. Kind of scared to come up with my final show. No. The final snack of the show. And he has the last one. This is the last one. This is a cider right here. Let's see it in here. Let's see it in here. This is right here, guys. This is my heavy hitter. Comes out to this right here. This is called coconut sweets. Like, like I said, bro, homemade find it anywhere this comes like my uncle out this week without further ado this is the final one coconut sweets you eat it similar to this one right here so and pour it on the hand so guys you said she take enough you could either take it as little bit but i'm gonna take the whole thing yep. cheers yeah cheers dessert the coconut swing but it tastes like fur and bacon like it tastes like you <laughs> like bacon like initial on that it's really weird to say, but I love it. Yeah. So good. You said it tastes like bacon? Yeah, it tastes like bacon. Wow, I gotta taste it again though. It's just like, like that initial like flavor, it tastes like bacon. I could it's sweet. And then it's that sweet coconut after just. Just crunchy. I see where Jacob's coming from where he says bacon. I feel like it's like smoky. And. And. and oh. Have this with this, or have this with this. Can't go wrong. So I need. Uh, I'm speechless. Yeah. No worries. I don't even know what else to say. It's just so good. Yeah. It has like what you want that smoky, that sweet, like crunchy texture. <clears throat> it's savory. It's not salty. It's all sweet. This is beautiful. This right here is S tier. What are you giving it? This is my ultimate champion. That's the winner? Best snack, best snack, ass plus two. That's, That's the winner? The champion, yeah. Okay. That's the crunchy coconut sweets, dude. Insane. That's the winner. Insane. Yeah. Let's go. Guys, no. That's the video right there, team. Cameroon finally came up on top. We had to come through guys and represent. Thanks for making to the end of video. And just like I said, guys, if you stay to the end, you're in for a very special announcement. And that announcement is, I have vlogs that I took back home in Cameroon. Nice. So like my trip in Cameroon, I have a bunch of vlogs right there. So if, only if, I will only post that if we get 50 likes on this video right here, comments, Spam the likes right there. Subscribe button, like all of that, all of that. Boom, Jacob said it best. Hit the subscribe button right there. And guys, on our previous videos, thank you so much for support. Amazing, right? You've been seeing the support we've been getting. I can't wait to see the new videos, Kawaii. Hey, I, I, I can't bring it out unless we get 50 likes on the video, guys. Let's get this video to 50 likes. Smash the like button, baby. Let's smash the like button. Did I see? Oh, man. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go. This is the end of the video, and we will see you in the next one. Dust. Boom.